Nampa police are partnering with several car dealerships. They're offering to mark your car's catalytic converter for free. The process is designed to make the converter traceable should it ever be stolen, and police hope that it will deter criminals from stealing converters here in the Treasure Valley. Catalytic converter theft is on the rise, and Nampa police are well aware. Yes, yeah, so there's been a huge uptick in the theft of catalytic converters. We've noticed it over really about the last year and a half. Uh, it's, been a, it's been a big problem. There's two main reasons that they're being stolen more often. A thief can take a catalytic converter within 30 to 50 seconds, so somebody can go into a store while they're shopping, come back out, and it can be stolen. Besides being easy to steal, the converters are made from precious metals, so criminals can sell them to be smelted for a big payday. Nampa PD and several dealerships are taking action by offering catalytic converter etching. The process is simple. It's essentially putting a heat-resistant sticker with a traceable ID on the converter. That's then etched on by a tool so that even if the sticker peels off, the etching remains in the metal. While it doesn't directly prevent the converter from being cut off of a car, police hope that the marked converters will deter thieves since the stolen converter could now be traced back to them. Several customers came into Bronco Motors Nissan today to get their converters marked. The traceability giving some peace of mind. The fact that it could be traced, the fact that if something does happen, we'll at least be able to know that it's mine and hopefully trace it back to whoever ran off with it uh, makes me feel a lot better. I saw the big pile of them on the news the other day sitting in somebody's garage in Portland and I thought at least mine probably won't wind up there. There are two more etching events this week, one on Wednesday and one on Saturday. Now dealerships are asking that you schedule an appointment ahead of time because while the process only takes about 15 minutes on average, they do anticipate a lot of people coming in. For when and where you can get your car etched, go to IdahoNews.com.